This panel of the desk here is the output assigned section and it's probably the most important thing to understand for doing a large scale show. You'll notice that if I press select on any of the faders, then I've then got control over the output assigned section for that one fader. So I'm going to start by demonstrating switching off this button here while I'm selected on channel one. If I now press select on channel two, you see that light comes back on because I'm now using the output sign for channel two instead of channel one. So I'm gonna go back and switch on the stereo. The stereo um, button on output sign sends the output from whatever the selected channel is to the stereo master fader on the mixing desk. So if I press select on channel one, I've got an orange light on stereo, and I turn up channel one, any signal from here is going to the stereo fader, and because that's up, it can be heard in the auditorium. If, however, I don't have the stereo button in the output assigned switched on, then it doesn't go to the stereo, and at the moment, it's going nowhere.